Three Days Grace is currently out on the road with Shinedown, and if you saw their performance last night in Huntsville, Alabama, myself and a lot of other people are very jealous of you because you saw a historic performance from the band, and it was a big night for rock music. Three Days Grace shocking the crowd in attendance with a extraordinary performance bringing out their former vocalist Adam Gontier for the first time in over 10 years. It's hard to put into words just how special that is. The band released their debut album with him back in 2003. They've written a number of massive hit songs, everything from I Hate Everything About You to Never Too Late to Riot and many, many more. And Adam joined the band for two songs. They performed Riot and never too late, there were people in the crowd with tears in their eyes, thrilled to see this band reunited with Adam, as I'm sure how special that was for the band as well. Adam is weighing in on this, Three Days Grace is weighing in on this, who knows what this could lead to, but it is outstanding to see. Before we continue, if you're new to Rockfeed, be sure to subscribe with notifications on for the latest rock news. And also, don't forget to enter to win at the link in the description. We're giving away four VIP weekend passes to one of these festivals of the winner's choosing. I cannot wait. Welcome to Rockville, less than a month away, and I'm looking forward to seeing Event Sevenfold's first performance in years. You'll be riding in style at VIP all weekend long. Enter to win at the link in the description. So Three Days Grace is out on the road, and Huntsville, Alabama is a show for the books last night where the band brought out Adam Gontier, their former vocalist, they have really made musical magic together over the years, some major hit songs they've written together, and it was a special, special moment to see them back up on stage. Here's a little bit of that. Von Braun Center, we're about to go on stage. Brad, are you ready? I'm ready. All right. Matt, are you ready? I'm ready. Barry, are you ready? I feel like this was gonna be a special night. Hey, Adam, are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. All right. And you're in for a fucking treat. You're in for a fucking treat right now. I'd like to introduce an OG 3DG member, Adam fucking Gotcha. Three Days Grace has really broken the internet with this. There has been a strong reaction. Adam Gontier himself has weighed in. He says it's difficult to find the adequate words to describe what it's like to be up on stage with his brothers in Three Days Grace once again. He said last night was something special. Tough to find words that accurately describe the feelings that come along with a night like that. Being back on stage with Three Days Grace again was fucking amazing. Being together again, all of us again in one room, shooting the shit, Talking, laughing, and hanging out was even better. Love these guys. Always have. And then he posted at the bottom, the future is bright. Now, I had the opportunity to talk to Adam over the summer, and I asked him how he would feel about the possibility of working with Three Days Grace in the future, and this is what he had to say. With you guys kind of rekindling your relationship with Three Days Grace, there's a lot of speculation that maybe you guys could work together in the future. I don't know if that will happen or not. Is that something that you would ever be open to, though, if... It, at any point, the opportunity might present itself. You know what? <clears throat> yeah, I mean, for sure. We're, we've all grown up. It's been been a while, and nobody's there's no hard feelings or anything like that, and we're all in touch now, and we talk and text exactly. and stuff. So, yeah, I mean, we haven't really talked about um, doing anything, not yet anyway, but uh, I feel like uh, something like that is most likely, you know, down the road at some point. Um, yeah, definitely not. It would be uh, big. Yeah, it would be, it, it would be a lot of fun. So it'd I mean, be very big. Yeah, it, <laughs> it would be probably, very big. Yeah, probably would be. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You never know, man. We haven't really talked about it, but uh, yeah, I guess we'll see. You never, never know. Anything's possible for sure. So if you were at that show last night in Huntsville, you got to see a very special moment in rock history. As Adam says, the future is bright. Who knows where that will lead? But it sure sounds like it's going to lead somewhere good, and it's just great to see this. 
uh, as a personal fan of Three Days Grace to see how much music they've written that means so much to me and a lot of people. Uh, I would love to see them work together in some capacity in the future. Who knows where that, I'm not gonna begin to speculate. This is just so great to see how all of this is going. And let me know what you all think in the comments. Were you there at the show? What was the atmosphere like? It sounds like the crowd went nuts when he came out and they're breaking the internet from the response that I've seen even already. That's your latest update from Rockfeed. You can join the conversation over on Instagram and don't forget to subscribe with notifications on if you haven't yet.